I'm Joey Parr with GeekTart.com. I am here with Billy. We're in Las Vegas, Nevada, covering CinemaCon 2022. And we just got out of the big Warner Brothers presentation where they showed previews of a bunch of their upcoming films. And in this video, we are going to talk about Shazam! Fury of the Gods. Yeah, I'm, I was actually really excited about this because I was a huge fan of the original Shazam. I've been waiting for this for a while. Yeah, first film was great. Yeah, and now we got a lot of footage of the second one yep. today, it was pretty exciting. I mean, not a ton. I mean, it was like a teaser trailer, kind of. It was a ton for me. But there, there, was, there was some great stuff right. in there. So we start off the panel and we got uh, Zachary Levi come out. Yeah, yeah. It's fun to see him on he, stage, do his thing. He's always exciting. Um, and we got to see Helen Mirren. Yeah, she was there. She was there. She's in the movie. She plays the villain of the story. Yeah, Hespera. She was really personable. I was really excited to see her there. I was kind of lost that she was there. It was. Great. Billy got lost in her eyes. I did. Is how it goes. <laughs> so yeah, they got they came on stage. They talked about where the crew is at because at the end of the first film, the family all gets powers. Yeah, Billy Baston is almost eighteen years old now. He's right. trying to figure out what exactly he's going to do as an adult now. I mean, him and Zachary Lee are pretty much the same height, aren't they? Are it's they weird. like almost the same almost height there. now? Yeah. And I'm like, what happens when they are? the same like it's not he's not a kid anymore but they don't look alike at all so it's no. kind of weird it's it's kind of funny uh, it's just now it's just when he turns into shazam he's just more muscular yeah he's it's pretty buff. and a different face right because that's what <laughs> that's what they want so um i mean it was him and jack dylan grazer who plays freddie freeman in it yeah he's got his power he's still excited about his powers right and so they talked about it a little bit how they're excited to bring it into this uh second um movie and they want to keep the same magic they kept saying like we wanted to keep the same magic of this first movie because they liked what they had but now they're just taking it to the next level they've been doing the superhero thing for a while now right they are you know kind of seasoned veterans of heroing right and now we get to see what happens when maybe their powers have gained the attention of um some bad people like like Helen Mirren and Lucy Liu, who play sisters, yeah. uh, that are there to kind of like even the odds, apparently. Uh, they think they're on a mission for good, yep. but by doing this, they're destroying the city. And... They're on a mission of evil. Right. They just don't know it yet. Right. I there's, mean, there's Helen Mirren talked about her character, just like, like most villains, they think they're doing good in the world, and that's what their whole thing is. But, you know, in the end, they're still villains doing bad things. And, mm -hmm. Heroes need to come in to stop them from doing things, and they showed some footage. They showed us, uh, you know, a bit of footage. It starts off with uh, Shazam and Wonder Woman. In Paris. In Paris, and Wonder Woman's got his back to him, and he's, like, kind of gushing over her. and How they could be god and <laughs> goddess together, and then turns out it's a dream. Yeah, it's a dream, because when Wonder Woman turns around, it is not... Wonder Woman. No, it's the face of the wizard, <laughs> uh, Dishman Hansu, yep. saying, Billy Bastion! And then <laughs> he wakes up. So we are going to get more of him in this movie. He, he's continuing, his character is continuing on into uh, this this feature. So Yeah, and then there's a bunch of footage that they show. There's like a dragon in the streets of the city that looks kind of cool. Then you've got, um, what else? Like, there's a place that had a whole bunch of books that were flying around. Oh, yeah, it, yeah, it looked like something from... The Here. Page Master? Right. Ooh, the Page Master. I like it. Yeah, and um, just th them still in their ch uh, you know children forms, and they're ready to continue to be superheroes. So we get to see both sides of that coin. And then the footage ends with Shazam sitting down with Helen Mirren's character, and he starts giving her this, this spiel about saying, like, I've seen all the Fast and the Furious movies, and you know what... The Fast and Furious movies are all about family. <laughs> and then he like waits. And he's like waiting for all of his family to like come in, but they were fashionably late. late. And they kind of missed the mark. Which he, you know, <laughs> in a Zachary Levi kind of way, kind of ribbed him a little bit about it. And it was fun. It was fun to yeah, see. It looks like a fun movie. I mean, if you like the first one, you'll like the sequel. I mean, I haven't seen the sequel, but from what I've seen for the footage, it looks like it's going to be just as good as the sequel was. I don't know if it'll be any better or any worse. All I know is it looks like it'll be just as good. Yeah, if looks it's, fun. If it's better, great. Exactly. I'll take it. So all We right. need more good DC films. Exactly. All right, stay tuned. We got more videos coming, and goodbye.